This is uh, an interview practice on Code Signal website, uh, and it is day 15. Uh, it is about uh, cryptarism. A cryptarism is a mathematical puzzle for which the goal is to find the correspondence between letters and digits such that the given arithmetic equation consisting of letters holds true when the letters are converted to digits. You have an array of strings scripts, the cryptarism and an array containing the mapping of letters and digits in the solution. The array crypt will contain three nanometer strings that follow the structure, word one, word two, and word three, which should be interpreted as the word one plus word two equals word three. If that returns true, that is a cryptarism, and that validates an arithmetic equation. If crypt, when it is decoded by replacing all of the letters in the cryptarism, with digits using the mapping in the solution, it becomes a valid arithmetic equation containing no numbers with leading zeros. The answer is true. If that will not containing any uh, numbers with a status with zero, that is true. And that is a valid arithmetic equation and that is called a cryptalism. If it doesn't become a valid arithmetic solution, the answer is false. It's going to return false. Not that number zero doesn't contain leading zeros. Will while, for example, zero zero or zero one to three do. So this is an example. Uh, the example is a crypt that contains three words array of three words, send, more, and many. And the cryptarism is that the sum of the first word and the second word, it gives that the third word. That is a cryptarism, and that validates an arithmetic solution by mapping the digits from the solution, the corresponding digits from uh, solution, and replace each characters in the crypt by the corresponding digits from solution. So uh, our, our target is we are going to solve this problem and we are going to just write an algorithm to solve this problem. Either uh, this is a cryptarism or not. Okay. In my solution, uh, first I'm going to iterate over each characters in the solution solution uh, when i'm going to iterate over each uh, i just uh, iterate uh, each row because this is a two dimensional array and i'm going to just iterate over each row each row contains a two uh, uh, elements that is index zero and index one, I can simply uh, filter uh, each index. And uh, target is just replace the corresponding uh, digits from the solution uh, to the characters in the crypt. Okay, crypt at index zero uh, is replaced by crypt at index zero replace by character at index zero. That is when, when you iterate over each uh, row, you can obtain index at zero, the character and the crypt. Then by digits uh, at index one in the solution, replace by ch at index one. We have three consecutive uh, three words in the crypt, and we are going to just uh, do the same thing. Uh, so, 
I can uh, just repeat this one and I can change this by index one and two. Uh, this not be changed because each row have index zero and one and it's going to replace the character by digit. Okay, now uh, is just validating uh, the crypt which is containing uh, leading zeros or not. If crypt at index zero starts with zero character or zero digit and the lane of crypt at index zero is different from one. This is one condition and we will have uh, two other conditions and we conjug uh, uh, combined by or or crypt at index one start us with zero and the lane of crypt at index one is different from one. And I have left one more or crypt at index two, the last word starts with zero digits and lane crypt at index two is different from one. Okay, if satisfies this condition, which means the either one of the three words containing leading zeros or starts with zero, or the length of the first uh, word or uh, the second word, the third word is different from one, it returns false. That is not a valid arithmetic, or uh, that is not a cryptorism. Otherwise, it's going to return by comparing and converting each uh, digit we replaced here by uh, uh, the characters replaced by digit here, crypt at index zero class int crypt we because addition not be uh, possible in uh, if that is uh, in a string so we, we have to convert the digits into integer to uh, perform an arithmetic equation index one if that's equal to int at crypt index two. That is what uh, it's going to satisfy this one, this one. That's going to return true. Okay, finally, we click on run test to test our solution is correct or not. Okay, let's do it. Click on run test. Yeah, uh, our solution is correct. And finally, we also uh, click on submit button to uh, check the hidden testers. Click on submit. Finally, it is correct. Uh, and this is my solution. And it checks the uh, cryptari uh, cryptarism algorithm that is a mathematical puzzle. And you can also uh, do your uh, solution uh, to solve this problem. Thanks for watching now.